want to let you know the Buffalo Marathon will be here before you know it. It's 10 weeks away, May 28th, but right now is the time to register and hopefully you've been in shape all year and ready to go because you'll be running with not only so many Western New Yorkers, but with people from around the world who come in for this. Executive Director and Race Director Greg Weber is with us this morning to talk about registering now and, and, and really how much this race is getting attention from people from around the country. So, in, and again, that's great. That means you're doing a great job. Um, my committee is doing a great job. <laughs> the city's doing a great job. Everybody's working hard to make it a community event. Yeah. You know, we've taken it from a Sunday event and it goes from Friday to Monday now. You said you came back from a trip where other uh, directors of races are really noticing what we're doing here in Buffalo. Um, I was in Florida a couple weeks ago at a running conference and some of the major marathons around have asked me what we're doing. They've heard of us, they're watching us, and I become friends with a lot of the race directors from those races. That's wonderful. And you were telling me that, that a, a, a pretty significant portion of the runners for this race come come in from out of town. Yeah, last year we had about 30% come in from out of, out of town, out of the area. Uh, we had 46 states, 15 countries, so wow. people know about Buffalo. They're coming to see us. Well, what is it about running, Greg, that just... I mean, we have, a, we have a nice contingent here from Channel 7 who will be running. In fact, I think we're going to be part of a race, a, a water stop. Yeah, it's, yeah. It, we're happy to have you back as our media sponsor. And Yay. last year it was a little, a little short notice for us to get you a water stop. But you know what mile you're going to do, right? Uh, no, seven. Get, yeah, there you go. <laughs> I knew that. Yeah. Uh, you're going to be at mile seven, so that should be a lot of fun. That's going to be a lot of fun. That's going to be great. And we'll have a lot of our talent who's running as well. But, I mean, it's, it, it's, a, it's a social event for a lot of people to get out and be a part of the Buffalo Marathon. It is, it, it is hugely social. The race, a lot of people are really competitive, but we've backed it off on Saturday. We have a kids race. Last year we had 350 kids run. Um, that's a free event. We have a 5K that's run before that. Um, it's become a family-friendly 5K. Mom, dad, their kids run across the line together. Um, it's a lot of fun to watch. It's a lot of fun to produce. I told you I'm a walker, but you say I could walk. Uh, I can walk it. How fast do you walk? I can walk pretty fast. <laughs> okay, so <laughs> if I give you an entry, will you go try? I will try. Okay, I will try. deal. Yeah, all right. Deal. Okay, all right. This is going to be great. I'll and be there to give you your medal. All right, that'd be awesome. That would be a first for me, let me tell you. I don't know if anybody will be left by the time I cross the finish line. But I'll be there I, for I'll you. I'll give it a shot. I'll give it a shot. And I think Courtney is going to get in shape for this, too. You also try to do so many other great things with this. You have a para-athletic camp. Uh, yeah, this first year for this, we gave back last year $75,000. Uh, that's been traditional through the years, and we've broadened it out to give to organizations that help the community. Oh, that's great. Uh, we do Girls on the Run, Boys on the Right Track, Yogis in Service that bring yoga to the inner city and underprivileged areas. And this year we have a camp from a group called Running for Those Who Can't. Um, they're going to make this camp available to people who wouldn't otherwise have the opportunity. They still have slots available. Mm -hmm. You can go register. And I understand there's a webinar tonight for people who'd like some information. Uh, we're yeah, our we have, we partner with a physical therapist. He is doing and he has a running uh, business. He's doing strength and conditioning webinar on Facebook. The information's on our Facebook page, mm -hmm. um, and he's going to do four or five more webinars leading up to the race for prepping for the race. That's wonderful. That is terrific. So that's tonight at eight o'clock. And give me the website again. So well, this is on our Facebook page Facebook. at Buffalo Marathon, doc, Buffalo Marathon on Facebook. Great. How many runners can you take for the Buffalo Marathon? Um, we control the growth. Uh, we've already ordered all our shirts and medals. So this year it'll be somewhere between seven and 8,000. That's amazing. But people should register now. We sold out the relay yesterday. Really? We have about 20% left in the full and the half. So I wouldn't delay. It's going to be a good time. It's, and it's, it's growing. It's constantly growing. And that's great because Western New York, then we're starting to pay a lot of attention to our health and, uh, and being well and even attempting something like this. Uh, it, it, you, you, know, you know, you may not get a medal for it, but if you're out there and you're trying and you're, you know, you're thinking about your good health, this is what it's all about. I mean, everybody who runs the 5K gets a medal. Everybody who runs the kids race gets a medal. Everybody who runs a half and full that crosses the finish line gets a medal. That's wonderful. That is great. And we're so looking forward to it. Plus, when everybody comes, usually you have good weather for this. It's funny how it works out. But everybody gets to enjoy um, that beautiful race route as well. Yeah, the, we go past some of the best architecture in mm -hmm. the city. We run through the parks. It's a great way to see Buffalo, and that's what a lot of people have talked about. Yeah. You know, they love seeing the city. Last year it was a little warm, but the city came out in force. 
and we got rave reviews over the support from just the residents of the city. Oh, that sounds great. Well, I can understand why people around the world are starting to take notice, Greg. You're doing a great job with this. And we want everybody to remember that it's just a short 10 weeks away. So by all means, get yourself registered for the Buffalo Marathon. We know a lot of people wouldn't miss it. And Channel 7 is really, really uh, proud to be a part of it this year. So don't forget the live webinar Q&A tonight at 8 o'clock on their Facebook page. And please go to their website and get yourself registered because it's going to be a good time in Buffalo.